I gotta say, I think this was one of my favorite abandoned cars that we've ever done in Need for Speed Payback. Now, it's definitely my favorite car out of the new four that we just got recently, but probably one of the most fun cop pursuits overall. So, you're gonna get to see the full cop pursuit gameplay here in just a second, but just for everyone to make sure everyone can easily find this, the abandoned car's location is right here at the very bottom middle part of the map. If you have this gas station, which this particular gas station has been very useful because three of the abandoned cars now have been very close to it, so I highly recommend just fast traveling to this gas station and really short distance to get to the abandoned car. So we're in my Mazda RX-7, we're gonna drive right over there just for anyone who might not be familiar with the game or the map or, you know, the roads here just to get over there as quickly as possible, especially for someone who ends up watching this video on one of the final days, which you're gonna have until Monday, July 16th to get this abandoned car. So July 16th, 2018, make sure you get this thing before then. We are talking about the level 204 off-road spec of the Subaru WRX STI, the hatchback version. And if you don't have it yet, which I personally did not, there is one of the little collectible coins right here. So that was a cool little extra bonus just for getting this abandoned car. Now this is actually Udo's car from one of the street leagues. Now I forgot that, I haven't done anything with the street cars and the street leagues and all that. I need to start doing those because that was something I did like way early on in this game. But for some reason, I just kind of like, I guess forgot about them. I just never really like thought to do them or continue with them. So I really need to go race all of the free roam racers and then, you know, beat the bosses. So Udo is the off-road boss here for League 73, I think it is. now. This cop pursuit, it was just so much fun because I was off-road practically the entire time. Obviously, this is an off-road Super WRX, so I mean, this thing's perfect for this. But the route that I took was a ton of fun, and there was just some epic stuff that happened here. So, just real quick, I'm going to let you just take a little listen in here and a little look in, but I will be right back to talk a little bit more. Yo, they must have dropped that cop out of the sky. Like, I was playing, I was driving, I was like, what is that, a bird? And then I realized it's a freaking cop car, man. Yo, that thing must have either launched at, like, 200 miles per hour, because you know how insane the cop cars are in this game, how they just accelerate 0 to 200 within, like, a second. Or that thing just got dropped off from outer space. I mean, that... That was crazy. I, I've never seen anything like that. The cops have done some pretty crazy things in this. I flipped, like, really hard into just different things and just spun around, done barrel rolls because the cops are hitting me. But that was one of the just most ridiculous things that I have seen in this game. But it was so funny, and this cop pursuit was just a ton of fun. So I did get it first try. I think this is, like, the first time in the last few weeks that I... Really didn't have a tough time getting away from the cops, but the cops, man, they just, I don't know why they fly so far, especially because their cars are heavier. When they take off of, over those off-road hills, they just go flying, but I did some pretty good maneuvering. It was a lot of fun driving here. I even avoided the rhino. I was like, hmm, how can I do this? I still hit the traffic car, of course, but better than the rhino, right? The rhino, I probably would have been busted if I got hit by that thing, especially because there wasn't really too much room to work with there, not a lot of room to wedge around, but... This was a fun one. I really hope everyone else had as much fun with this one as I did, but again, I showed you the location of the abandoned car. You see the car here. I do showcase it at the end and prove to you that it is off-road, level 204, and Rav, all he had to say was, hey, nice car you found. I was like, man, they're not paying you much to talk, are they? <laughs> they didn't want to pay him for any new lines or anything like that, so he's just saying pretty much nothing at this point with these new abandoned cars but this is the fourth new abandoned car no more repeats for the time being we're going through the street bosses cars and we had a cop car the crown vic so who knows what else they're going to add in it's nice to see some new things though for sure hopefully everyone's been enjoying them i still enjoy doing these abandoned cars especially when the copper suits are fun like this but i'm gonna get out of here peace
freedom. Nice car you found there.